You gotta tell me right now, Barry. Why? You need to tell me, Barry. Why, Chris? Tell me right now! Don't just fucking sit there, you fucking tell me! You need to tell me! Enough! Enough! Shut up! I know evil, Barry. And you're not evil. But this has to stop. Starting now. What are you doing? Get back in there, Edmund. Elizabeth, it doesn't work yet. It's not even close to working yet. It's not supposed to work. It's a trial. Wait, this, this isn't what I do. I, I, I work with machines. I work with tech. I don't... How can we ask these people to... This isn't you. Now, I do not like speaking in absolutes. But I gotta tell you, fellas. I absolutely wish every single one of these corporate cockroach assholes be taken out to the woods and the woods set on fire. <laughs> hey, you with the headphones! Yeah. What the hell you think you're doing? All right, so let me get this straight. Um, you haven't placed a bug in there yet. No, we have not. You know what, it doesn't fucking matter. These pieces of shit are a known crime organization. So we send some units over there, we round up these fucking assholes, we bring them back here, we step on their necks and we see if their stories match up with Hank's, yes? Now, now. Okay, so I'm here in tall, Jewish, right? Maybe kind of soulful. That guy's definitely came to the right place. Um, let me ask you something. Does it have to be European white, or can it be maybe Hispanic? And the only reason why I ask this, right, is because I just signed this Cuban guy. He's so good. It looks like a cell phone, but it's really like a digital black hole. Wireless hard drive that swallows up any electronic data within 10 feet of it. Like what? Like the account info of anyone at Starbucks with a latte and a laptop. Like the PIN number of any credit card used at a gas pump. I can walk out of here and get the identities and financial statements of 10 people in 10 minutes on a slow day with one hand on my junk. And the information embedded in Scylla? If we can get close enough. It's ours. Hey, little buddy. You were never supposed to make it this far. When I pulled you out of that dumpster, I had no idea that you'd be such a world-class fighter. But you don't gotta fight anymore. Oh, you're not gonna eat any? No, I, I liquefied it. Okay. That was really great, Chicken Jingle. Mm, I love that fucking Chicken Jingle. Oh, hey, you had better chicken than that. You'd have to be a rooster. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't speaking of, who's up for some dessert? Oh. Oh, hey, Sue. Mike and I are going to go to the Cowboy Club after this, and if you want to join us, you know, they got really great dancing.